All right, all right. Good morning, party people. Hey, this your man Griff with a quick video. Um, a lot of people have been, as well as myself, getting emails from these companies asking us to pay to sign up into their databases, sending emails out like, hey, you're missing out on notary assignments in your area. There's an increased number of notary assignments, dot, dot, dot. And they're not offering any proof. They're just making these statements. And then they want you to sign up for their database. They can't guarantee you that a company will pick you. They can't guarantee that there's even orders in our area that they're servicing or anything. So when you get these emails and it's asking you to spend all this money to be in their database, I would, con I would honestly say stay away from it. That's not something you should be doing. Um, I don't. Um, there's only one that I pay for. That's one, two, three, notary. Oh, I'm sorry, three. I do the notary cafe, one, two, three notary and notary rotary. Those are the three that I do. Um, and I only do one, two, three notary because I got over 900 signings under my belt. So I got some experience there. Um, and I've made my money back. I actually did it and made over 300 bucks <laughs> um, the next day, actually, um, through them and made some connections. So, um, they're okay. I mean, they're okay. You know, so I'm, there's nothing negative I can say about them because I just started, you know, just being in a database and a couple of other notaries that I respect was talking about them and how things was working. So I figured I'd give it a shot myself and I've gotten two orders out of there, um, and made the money that I've invested back, which was $99. So there are some companies you can probably do that with, but I would say as a new notary, I would start off with just sticking with the free ones. Um, the only thing that I would pay as a new notary is with signing order. There, they have the two ninety nine dollars two dollars and ninety nine cent a month um, upgraded listing, and that seems to work. But a lot of these other companies um, call them and ask. I mean, they need to show some proof that it actually works and everything. So I don't want y'all just blowing your money. You're already spending enough money as it is. Um, also a lot of people are getting emails from companies saying, Hey, we found you in this database and we want to add, and we, um, we have an order in your area. Can you do it? And that's all the details they give you. And they're not giving you any other details. Be suspect of them. You know, when the email comes in, um, you actually need to look at the email and decide whether or not that it is actually coming from. I told y'all every time I get on these videos, all of a sudden orders start popping in. Um, you need to decide whether or not, um, you know, you need to look at their email and see if it's actually coming from that company. Because sometimes it'll have, <coughs> sorry about that. Sometimes it'll actually have, um, you know, somebody's name at outlook.com, somebody's name at gmail.com or some other crazy name. So if it doesn't actually have that company at thing at whatever that company is, be suspect of it. Call the number, call the actual company, reply back to the email, say, hey, give me a call. And, um, you know, a lot of y'all use the Google voice number. Give them your Google voice number. Say, hey, give me a call here um, so we can discuss. And if they call you, then you you grill them. You say, okay, who are you? How do you find me? What is this about? Give me some more details. What's your payment system? How do you transport for you know transport documents back and forth? You know, getting the documents to me. How do I get the documents to you? All of that. So just be very, very careful and vigilant out there because some of these people got some stuff going on that is creepy. Um, they trying to. I don't know why they trying to jack notary <laughs> notaries like this, but they are and. The whole time I've been out here, that's what I've been seeing. So just um, be careful out there. Check those emails. Verify that they're actual real emails coming from real companies. And do your due diligence so you're not getting scammed. All right. Peace.